Charlie Cadaver here again. With down with some LS car upgrades, as you see. Here's my weather beaten 98 WS6. As you can see, I got the Z51 Corvette C6 rotors on with Brembo's. I did that last night. I'm doing the other side today, which I'm going to show you how you do it. Now, <clears throat> I am, as you can see, because people have problems with running into the Brembo's being wider. They run into the spokes on your stock wheels, so you need spacers. But since I'm running Corvette wheels, you know, they have no backspacing. I mean, it's just completely flat after the spokes, unlike the stock fortune wheels they have like a good inch and a half uh hub on the out on the inside to bring the wheel out so without these spacers these wheels had no problem with turning and whatnot but they were not flush with the fender so um you know i got these off of ebay for uh just under 40 dollars ship for the pair um you know, they're hub symmetric, which is 70.3 millimeters. This is the one for this side. I already got everything taken off. Um, and the next step, I got the J56 option Brembo's off. Uh, it came actually off of a 2016 uh, Cadillac. Uh, CT6 okay N not the Camaro fifth gen type um, let's see the early CTS V's that a lot of people are using um, because with those ones the caliber bolt is the stock size as the fourth gen F bodies okay so you don't have to drill out the hub but these I have to drill out on my spindle which are these bolts right here or holes I'm sorry holes not bolts Durr. okay so I'm gonna drill them out you know they are uh, what uh, an M12 and they gotta be drilled 